Good afternoon, this is Taylor with Rentals in SF, and this is a video tour of 3911 22nd Street. Okay, fantastic. This is located in the highly desirable Noe Valley neighborhood, and you have uh, just borders the Castro, Dolores Heights, Upper Market, and here we are at the corner of 22nd Street and Castro Street. By the way, the main drag is 24th Street, and you'll find a Whole Foods and a lot of food and drink options um, just a few blocks away. Okay, here we are. What a, another gorgeous, beautiful, fabulous day in San Francisco. Looking around, uh, it's this lavender building directly in front of us. This is going to be a top floor unit. There is laundry and storage in the basement area. So, uh, but let's just go ahead and step up. And this is going to be a third floor walk up. Okay, the unit is right here on the right. Uh, it's currently occupied. Tenants are planning to vacate at the end of the month. So you'll get an idea of what it looks like when it's set up. By the way, dimensions are on the website. Full closet. Looks like there's room for a bed and a desk, which is great. Really beautiful views. This is, of course, top floor, nice sun, nice light. And hardwood floors throughout, of course. Okay. We'll go to the second bedroom in just one moment. Just let you know it does have a split bath. which is nice for roommate situations. A walk-in shower. Really charming living room. I've seen this room set up a few different ways and uh, I really just love the way it looks. That's a cool little built-in with games and booze. Fun. This does have a, a high uh, plate rail so you can lean your art up against it. Okay, eat in kitchen includes a dishwasher and a gas range. By the way, this stairs uh, actually winds, there's a little storage here, but uh, pretty much it winds its way down to the laundry room and the storage in the basement area. So that's one way you can get there. The other way would be go down to the main stairs we came up. Okay, let's take a look at one more bedroom that we skipped over, right in, located in the front. I call this the middle bedroom. little corner closet here. Not huge, but definitely something. I believe that's a full-size bed, but certainly could accommodate a queen-size bed. Uh, one more closet here. A standard Okay, let's take a look at some still images. And these will be great because they're vacant shots. You get to see what it looks like vacant, which of course it will be.
Okay, thank you so much for watching and best of luck in your home search.